read where we headed. Nice. We are. You guys, today it's a rainy day in Los Angeles, but it's a good day because we're heading to the Nars Boutique here in Los Angeles, and we're gonna try out their new foundation. I'm really excited about that because the new foundation from Nars is that's exciting, right? Yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe. So we are talking about Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation today. There are 33 shades, which is incredible. Um, one thing that I love about NARS is that we've always been really inclusive of every complexion from the fairest to the deepest. Um, and 33 shades is uh, nothing to see that. So it's a 16 hour wear, which is really incredible and really works on all different skin types, but gives you that radiant finish that we all love and love. I'm excited, I'm gonna try out this foundation now, they're gonna shade match me, and they're also gonna shade match me with their concealer. Even though I use it, I already know my color. They have six new shades, so there might be a new shade for me. First we have Santa Fe, uh -huh. and then we also have Fiji. So these have a little bit more of a golden undertone. Okay, um, this one is Santa Fe. This Santa Fe one. Fiji, yep. You know I'm from Santa Fe. Are you? I am It's meant to be. It Santa might be Fe. meant to be. I hope it's Santa Fe. Who knows? It's really best to do this without a primer, actually, because of the 16-hour wear. Wait, so you recommend no primer? No primer, but super hydrated skin. This one's Fiji, okay. which is a little bit light, but still has a golden undertone. This one's Santa Fe, which I think is perfect. <gasps> it that might have been sense. meant to be, oh, right? you guys, I'm from Santa Fe. Nice. Right? How do you like it? I like it. Yeah? Okay. Feels nice too. We really recommend using your hands with this. Okay, so, so no brush. No brush. Um, Mr. Nars does not believe in brushes for foundation. He believes in everything should be done with your hands. She's hoping. <laughs> Hi, Red. So you have a little bit of pink and yellow in your skin. So um, I kind of went with, I'm going to start with a little bit of pink. We'll kind of see if those do anything. And that one is Vienna is what I'm going to start with first. So the second one I'm doing, which is a little light, is Mont Blanc. Mont Blanc, Mont Blanc. For those fair maidens. Third one, which I think is good, is DeVille. DeVille, you're like Cruella. Cruella. So I like to test on the jaw specifically just because I can then easily see how it matches to the neck. Um, so it's doing less work. I like this one. Cruella, DeVille. Oh, it's DeVille. DeVille. But you'll, now you'll always remember it like that. Cruella. I think these were a little too yellow, a little too light, as you can obviously yeah. see the difference. Okay everyone, so I've had the NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation for a couple of days and I've been using it. I really like it. So I just wanted to show you before I wrapped up this video um, what it looks like. So I'm gonna put this on first. I have my skincare on, um, my vitamin C, I have a little bit of SPF and a little bit of moisturizer on as well. They told me you only need one pump. I feel like I'm using like more like two pumps, but it, you know, it's like very small. It's basically um, pea size and you know, they said use your fingers, which I don't usually apply my foundation with my fingers, but I'm going to for, for this one, just to show you guys. I'm gonna use a little bit of concealer. I really do use the NARS concealer. I'm, my color is custard. I've been using it for a while. I just put a little triangle here. So that is what my skin looks like with the NARS foundation. 
a little bit of the concealer and it looks really good. Very smooth and it's been lasting all day long. I have definitely been putting it to use. Um, I'm gonna do the rest of my makeup really quickly and then I'll show you my final look. If you guys are wondering what bronzer I'm using, this is Chanel. It is a brand new Soleil Tan de Chanel. Um, it's basically like a cream bronzer. I've been using this for years. Um, my makeup artist, Nikki, uses this on me all the time too. And it's, it's just so good. It's really easy to use. And that's my final makeup look. It's obviously a very simple makeup look. Um, I'll put links to all of the products I used down below. Um, I just wanted you guys to, you know, see what this foundation looks like all over my skin. I think it looks really good. I like the way it wears. It feels very light um, and it blends beautifully. That's my favorite part about this foundation. Um, tell me in the comments below if you're going to try this foundation, if you've tried it, if you love it, um, what you think it looks like on my skin, and if you like it. And make sure to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.